Hey there, Ricardo Bueno here, DiverseSolutions.com, and in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add an image, a hyperlinked image, as a tech w text widget on your WordPress blog. Yesterday, we released some free IDX home search icons, so today I want to show you how to take those icons and hyperlink them to the home search page on your website uh, with little to no knowledge of HTML. So here, you'll see that I'm logged into the WordPress dashboard. Uh, never mind some of these items that are out to date. We need to update to the latest version of WordPress. What, what I'm going to do here is log into my dashboard, and I'm going to go to a post and click on Add New to create a new post. Only in this case, I'm not really creating a new post. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use the visual editor and the media button to go ahead and add an image and then hyperlink it while I'm doing so and then what 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 I can do is toggle between my visual and HTML editor to actually grab the HTML that I'm going to use to insert as a text widget so here first thing I'm going to do is go into this uh, post area I'm going to click on the icon to add media and it gives me my little pop-up window where I can click and drag the, the files what I'm going to do is I'm just going to click and drag the call to action or the button for the image that I want to add. In this case I'm taking one of the IDX home search icons, the advanced map search icon, and it goes ahead and automate adds it for me using their process. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to title this advanced Irvine home search. Go ahead and title that the same. and then down below where it says link URL well I don't want it to go to the media upload URL which it created here automatically instead I want it to go to the home search page so all I'm doing is I'm adding my hyperlink in other words where I want this page to take users I'm adding that link this is where I have my IDX home search embedded under mysite.com forward slash home dash search that's where my IDX search is embedded on this site so I want the link URL to point to that page and then I'm gonna uh, in terms of alignment I'm gonna set it to none in terms of size it's set to 312 by 250 uh, depending on your sidebar your sidebar might be 250 pixels in width or a hundred um, or, or 200 pixels in width so I'm just gonna select the thumbnail view here and click on insert into post what it does is it go ahead and inserts that image into my post editor as you see here the question is how do I grab that then and add it as a text widget on my sidebar well if you toggle between the visual editor and the HTML editor within WordPress your post editor it takes you to the section where you can just grab the HTML so here I'm just gonna copy that HTML. I'm going to go to Appearance and click on Widgets. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag a text widget into the section in my primary sidebar where I want that new call to action to appear. I'll just click on Save. And if I go to my website, you'll see that it went ahead and added the advanced map search icon or that call to action to my website. Now I reduced that uh, far too much so if depending again on the sidebar for your website you might want to set it to either 300 pixels or 250 pixels it, again that all just depends entirely on your uh, sidebar so here I'm going to go ahead and add the full size again insert into post and I'm just going to reduce that a little bit so that it's not as large and again all I'm doing is copying that and pasting it into the HTML view uh, the HTML into that text widget so that I get a call to action that appears a little bit bigger and there you go when you click on that it takes you to the home search page on your website ideally where you have the IDX placed hopefully without the sidebar so that it fits a little more uh, consistently within the page so quick hack for adding a hyperlinked image as a text widget on your website hope that helps and again thanks for watching